In this video, I will show you how you can transform or loft between multiple shapes in Blender. So let's say we have a couple of shapes, a circle, a square, and a triangle, and we arrange them in one path to make a mesh from those three with smooth transition. The tool we need to go by is edge looping. So we need to join those three shapes in one object with Control J, then in edit mode, we switch to edge selection, hit A to select all, and with your right mouse button, choose Bridge Edge Loop. The result is kind of messed up, and you can play with the numbers on the pop-up menu. You might like that in some cases, but this is an error, and it's because the vertices' numbers do not match between the shapes. You can see the circle has 16 vertices, while the other two shapes are 4 and 3, so we need to match them up. We can subdivide the square two times, and the triangle is the same, subdivided a couple of times then delete some of the vertices with Control x or subdivide a specific edge from it, just match it to the same number as the others. And now, if we do the edge loop one more time, the result will be much nicer, and we can go into adding some cuts on it, or play with the smoothness value which is best at default one. Then with some modifiers like solidify and subsurface, you can get some nice results by lofting between shapes in Blender. Like you can add a circle and a rectangle shapes, then do the same method and before and play with the smoothness and profile in the pop-up menu to get this piece for a hairdryer. It's the basic shape, but you get the point of transforming in Blender from now on. And that's it. If you want to learn about smooth shapes merging in Blender, do watch this video and see you next time. Stay sharp. Goodbye.